sets though. Uh, we got Vega Destroyer, or I think it's just Vega now. Yeah. But um, Vega and Failbot. So Vega Destroyer sounds kind of menacing. <laughs> <laughs> I think it, it, it was Vega Destroyer, and then everyone's just you know obviously they're not gonna call him Vega Destroyer. They're just gonna say Vega, and so yeah. it's like ah well that's got a good name to it. Um, and then Failbot, who's uh, used to be Matt W and used to rock the bale. Yeah, but and then she got nerfed, and then <laughs> he kind of <laughs> moved on. Got into Falcon, who has never. I think. Nerfed. I think he. Actually, I don't know if that's true or not, but he played Falcon before, I think. Right. And then he. Well, I mean, he had he had to play somebody before Bale. Yeah, I mean, not necessarily. Well, yeah, well, I mean, got a good point, but. Ooh, all right, in the battle of the the green skins. I don't. Okay, I'm gonna be honest. I don't know about you. If, but if someone picks like a green color or the same color as me, <laughs> I have to switch. It's just <laughs> no, I don't feel that way at all. But it's like one of those weird little quirks, you know. I, I mean, I. Oh, like you mean I'm, like, like if of I, if the I'm same ba character? Yeah. Or okay. Like, not even of the same character. Like, okay. So I don't know, man. If I'll I was either Vega or Matt W, and these are my main colors, I'm switching colors because right. I don't want to be the same color as my. I opponent. mean, most times I pick the purple color, which is typically a safe bet. So. Yeah. Oh, uh, no punish. Uh, he had so much time. And it'll be interesting to see how a failbot deals. Vega likes to do a lot of the B reverse uh, or sphere charge. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And we'll see how failbot deals with that. I'm not sure if he's ever you know, fought Vega before or Lucario for that part, matter. Yeah. But, you know, any Dishonest Lucario character. that he's fought, I'd assume would be like online. Because I think Vega, for the most part, is our only one here. Yeah. I mean, we got Xander, but he's been in Wisconsin for a while. And even then, he's been playing a lot of me brawler too. Right. He's on that train. Ooh. Ooh. All right. Oh. Misses the. Uh, I don't think he quite had the correct spacing no. for that. I'll say. <laughs> <laughs> and that's that's another move though. Very easy to punish, and Vega just kind of lets it lets it go. Lucario low profile that that grab. Yeah, it did. Kind of surprised me. It's a very even game. I, I I get the feeling that Vega's. Struggling a little bit with the idea of like Captain Falcon's neutral a little bit. Mm. Oh, yeah. yeah. And that is a uh, side B for days. Not quite going to do it. Not even with uh, all the aura. Aura plus rage. And this is, I was about to say, a, like a nice little shield mm. break setup. Ooh. Surprised we didn't see a grab out of Vega there. Or out of Failbot. And whoever actually gets his first stock will have huge advantage. Um, Ooh, because nice. you definitely want to take take out Lucario when possible. Mm -hmm. that's yeah, that's, that's definitely it. Because we almost saw uh, killed, you know, 30% ago. So, and that was, you know, Vega had less uh, aura as well. Though. And now this is when Lucario gets really scary. I don't uh -huh. like that. I don't like when Falcons feel the need to go for a forward forward air like that off the forward throw. Yeah. Or down throw. I mean. <laughs> that can be the hard part where there's just a bit of a snowballing effect for Lucario where it's just so hard to get rid of him because he's so floaty. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and Failbot seeming to have a lot of trouble with uh, this movement option by Vega. Yeah, all right. he's, he's going all in on Raptor Boost, too, which is an idea that I don't particularly care no. for. It's good if you catch opponents who are, like, approaching a lot and not really doing a lot of shield, but Vega's definitely not approaching. He's pretty content to just sit here with uh, Aura Sphere. If he had ran the other way, maybe he could have gotten a forward throw, but I still don't think it would have killed. Ooh. Oh, oh turn around. boys, boys. Turn around right now. <laughs> All right. Vega dropping shield while up on that Smashville platform. We'll have a slightly more difficult time killing now, but still Falcons at 127. So. Rage is a funny mechanic, though. Or is an even funnier mechanic. And that's the thing, one down air will uh, just take it all away here. So Vega's definitely got to watch himself. Forward air. He's got to watch himself off stage. Okay. Whoa. Or the people's elbow. Up tilt is another good one to punish a recovery. Knowing that Failbot was overcommitting to that edge guard, just Vega goes for the roll option. I feel like I feel like Failbot is kind of telegraphing a lot of his follow-ups. You know what I mean? When he gets a grab, like yeah. he doesn't really make it much of a secret what he's gonna do. Yep. Yeah, I think Falcon is a great character if you can really mix it up. Ooh, and I like that Raptor Boost idea. Because he kind of caught Vega rolling yeah. in. Oh, wow. that will take it. Yikes. 
The cheese are getting out. Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> and that was a really smooth comeback from, well, I wouldn't call it smooth maybe, but a clutch comeback from Fail by that, that was pretty clutch. Like, we weren't given a much of a chance being down one, you know, 127. Because even then, he only took like 25% out of that. Yeah, and that's the thing about Falcon. He's got a lot of good frames and a lot of moves, you know, tack up small damage over time. And then it helps that he got a couple of, like, charge forward smashes in there to, uh, you know, add 20% at a time. So we'll see. Vega. Ooh, Duck Hunt. All right. I, I, I get the feeling he's going here just for the space. The space, yeah. Because it's run away. You know, in, in almost every aspect, it's really, it's very spacious. So much open sky. Ooh, and the song roll. So many, so much room to shoot ducks. <laughs> so much room to giggle behind a bush. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dog. <laughs> I don't know. That's what the dog does, man. What do you want from me? He's very literally pointing out what the dog does on the stage. <laughs> All right, and we got soft spot knee. And hoping for a neutral get up there, Failbot was. Came already kind of a, a bit closer than the last one was, but. But now we can see. But Vegas kind of settling into his own where he's getting he's getting a lot out of Horus here. Yeah. Here comes one. And it's such a like an unpunishable move, like falling on their shield. Like, I mean, such so unpunishable on shield, I, I should say. He needs to stop doing that. <laughs> how often has it worked? And was like. It's just one of those things where, like, you could kind of see that it, the make it, it wasn't Ooh. there. All right, and that was actually the first uh, or three charge and up smash that we saw kill from Vega this set. So yeah, I think he got one earlier last yeah, set. He did. Yeah, he did. And uh, that was that was when his uh, aura was like completely diminished. Though. Ooh, oh, wow. really? Are you waffling there? Really? I don't know, man. But he kind of hovered at the ledge. Yeah, it, it definitely uh, did not look like. I think Vega definitely wanted a ledge snap way before that. Mm -hmm. So again, like the last game, like we kind of, you know, Vega kind of settled himself in the first stock, kind of sticking to his game plan. But you know, Matt W can't be counted out yet. All right, we will see some extra percent here tagged on from Vega. Ooh, Ooh all right. That, that, one, that might have that actually is a, worked. That is a combo yeah. that exists and kind of makes me throw up, but it's all right. Oh, and that tech roll in, had Vega been anticipating that, definitely would have been able to get a meaty punish. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just going to stop. <laughs> there's, there's, it's a good thing there's no camera on me. <laughs> just the visible cringe the by Spinner every time he goes for a knee. I bet that Falcon kick... It's just a bit too far away to be. Yep, and that's blocker. the thing. On on a different stage, that probably would have been a smarter Falcon kick. But there's so much space on this stage. Oh wow, the what? down tilt! Oh no way! You can Dang. tell Vega wasn't expecting that. No, that's not an edge guard he was going for. No, I don't think he. I don't think he died for that the right way no. either. He was definitely not preparing to get hit by uh, that angle. Dang. Because he kind of poked his head above. Failbot above definitely the ledge clutching there. it out there. Um, definitely using you know some some good Falcon buttons to. Uh, 